Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we got Yenfei to join our group. It is a different Yenfei from a different uh, timeline and personality or possibility or whatever. But it's a Yenfei nonetheless, and Seiri is happy to have him. But not happy enough to actually talk to him because she can't actually communicate with him. He could only talk to... Where the fruit is he? Yenfei. He can only talk to Robin because Robin's sexuals. In this episode, we are going after another person who should be dead, but uh, somehow isn't dead, even though we killed them like a bajillion times already. Uh, we're running out of options, so I'm sure you know who it is at this point, so let's not even try and be coy with it. Let's not mince words. Let's just go ahead and get them over here. Now that's taken care of. Uh, question is, do I need anything? Do we get anything? We didn't get any supports between the... Those of us, my god, how much thinking talking do these guys need? Uh, I guess we're gonna be heading into the next chapter. Let me just check my inventory real quick. Okay, I think I'm good to go. It's time for Wellspring of Truth in Paralogue 22. What? Wellspring of truth. What is that? Some sort of local superstition? Ah. Closer to a legend, my lord. Apparently, the nearby ruins house an unusual spring. Many believe its waters reflect one's true self, whatever that means. Really? Whatever, indeed. I don't need some glorified puddle to tell me who I am. My true self. Huh? Aversa? Are you the real? Or are you an illusion? Huh? If you would learn the answer, give chase. What in the... Hey. Something wrong? Um. There, just now I... I may have seen Aversa. Hmm? You may have? Hmm. She seemed odd somehow. She said I should give chase to learn the truth. If she's alive, she could be spreading more of her venom across the land. Perhaps it's best if we made certain. So, who are we taking into battle? I'm not going to be using Yenfei, probably. He doesn't have a signature sword. I kind of wish he did. He just has another killing edge. Uh, but we still have his Amatsu. I'm going to try and hold on to this for the rest of the game. Even though we only have one more use out of it. Huh. I uh, guess I'm okay with having these two sit out. Because, um, Sumia isn't maxed out level, so maybe Olivia would be better. I gave her the Soul Caddy since she is a Myrmidon. Obviously, I, of course, know that since I care deeply about all of my units and know everything about them in this game. Um. I guess I just want to see what that's like, so I'll keep her in. I think I'm going to stick with this party, though. Because uh, Anna can only communicate with Robin. Eh, well then, in that case, how about get rid of Noe and we'll bring Anna in. View the map as well. Uh, pretty straightforward. There are some treasures. A lot of stinking... Level one enemies? Huh. I don't know what this is about. Wait, Aversa. But wait, you're you're Aversa? And you're Aversa? But who's driving the plane? Oh god. Uh, according to the map, uh this is an ally of Ursa, and that's an enemy of Ursa. Hopefully they're not lying to me. The way you recruit her is the same thing we do with Emeryne. As long as she's alive by the end of the chapter, we could recruit her. But question is, how difficult is that going to be? She has weapons here. Level 20 Dark Flyer. And a level 20 Dark Flyer. I guess it's just a matter of making sure she doesn't go run off and do anything stupid. Well, let's find out how stupid she is. Hmm. This spring reflects the truth. 
If doubt pounds you, have a look in down that dog forever. You may just find the new life in death, or perhaps the other way around. Hmm? Enough of your riddles. Who are you? I want the truth, and I want it now. <sighs> what? Another- Oh! No, 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 no. No! 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 Oh, I should have came in here with Donald. Oh, snap. I am the reflection of your true self. Face me, and in one of our deaths may the truth prevail. <sighs> if killing this guy stops this madness, then I'm all for it. Still, I don't relish the idea of fighting someone who knows my every move. Could I cheat the system and come in here with weak units? Let's look, uh, for example, Frederick, level 19 has all this stuff in his inventory and there Frederick is level 19 and has a different inventory they all have slightly different inventories they don't have useless weapons they all have weapons that they could use basically they oh god we have to f Oof. oh that's a new one I'm glad I didn't look this up just for the shock value but my God. Uh, do I have to talk to her? Uh, Philly. Crom, who do I even want you with? I don't know. I just want to make sure. Okay, that can't work. So she's just going to be going off on her own and we can't do anything about it. Oh, I'm going to hate this. I'm going to hate this. Oh boy. Uh, let's have Lissa with Frederick. Uh, Flavia with Basile as usual. Uh, well, I guess I'm glad I brought Anna and Olivia in here. No, they're strong. All of my guys are strong. This is gonna be a pain in the butt. At least I don't have any archers. Haha, -ha, my one advantage of over myself. Uh, Olivia with pain, I guess, and do we really have a even think? No, Longku isn't with anyone. Uh, I guess we're just gonna go forward. I have no idea this is gonna play out. Are they gonna like? Are they gonna charge us? Or are they gonna stay right there? I should probably say split up then. In that case, if they do charge us. Uh, you can't reach us right from here, can you? Uh, I can't even tell. I can tell if I do this. Okay, he can't. Uh, let's have... You guys go over here. I can't do anything with you because you're a jerk. Over here. Hopefully they don't do pair-ups. That would be very, very cruel. And, like, they don't get their our stat boosts, do they? Our relationship status boosts. Oh, jeez. They move. They're on the move. I was not expecting this. My god. That's a really cool fight, though. That's for sure. They use Rally! Okay, they use it a lot. Okay. I'll have to keep note of that. Maybe it's actually useful. Uh, Shadow Chairs. <laughs> I'm just gonna call them all Shadows. Uh... Okay, wow, we can take him out pretty easily. Let's go for it! Oh god, okay, thank you. Thank you for picking up the slack. Okay, one down. It might not be as difficult as I'm making it out to be. We'll see. Uh, go over here. Switch. Thankfully, we can attack from a distance. Hey, if we get rid of their Chrome and Robin, do we automatically win? So that's what happens when our Chrome and Robin go down. Should only be fair. Of course, you miss. Doesn't matter. Uh, Tiki gets 19 experience. That doesn't matter, as usual. Uh, we put you two right here, just because you can't attack anyone in this turn anyway. 
Uh, you found Titania's Axe. I know who that is. Uh, we'll go with... Ceres with Krom? Okay. Sari, you're gonna go... I kind of want to keep my distance still. I want the... I shouldn't charge this. Let's... Let's wait a bit, actually. Let's play this a bit smarter than I normally would. Uh, I know you never thought you'd see the day. Uh... Go down here. And... Hope for the best. Oh, jeez. Let's see what we got. Of course, they're going for Frederick first. Always got to go for him first. Thank you for guarding one of them. Prom using the spear? What? Okay. Robin using Belagna. Oh! No, no, no. Ouch. I had the option to move chairs too, didn't I? God darn it. Oh, and Robin's gonna die. Robin's gonna stink and die. Cool. I'm the best at this game. Uh, well, I lost a Cherish, and they lost a Cherish. We're both down a Cherish. Oh, uh, please don't kill me, please. Oh, God. No, one no, 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 77% chance, come on. God darn it. <sighs> Why is it every time I lose a fight, it's like right before battle where I like gave everyone a bunch of stinking stat upgrades that I gotta go memorize again and gotta buy more things again and oh my god. Well now that I know this I might want to change my team around. Give me a second. So now that I know what's going to happen I kind of want to use this as an opportunity to take a little trip down memory lane. So I still working with communications for Lucina and Tiki and Flavian Basilo so they're gonna stay. But what happens if I get rid of everybody else also I'm questioning what happens when I get rid of everyone in general is it just gonna be like a bunch of croms will it be my strongest fighters do they know that I'm trying to cheat the system uh we'll think about it give me a second just want to save make sure I don't have to do that again all the backtracking um I guess, first off, let me see what happens when I do just this, because, like, they're still there. So, what's going to happen, I wonder? Let's see. Hmm. Hmm? It is... It's just a bunch of Kroms and Lucinas and Flavias and Basilos. Hmm. Hmm. So it's not a good idea to go in here with a small group. Well, in that case, we will have a little trip down memory lane, why don't we? Just give the characters that we didn't really use in our adventure a last second chance to uh, be part of this story. Oh my god, this is going to be amazing just cheating the system like this. I'm very much okay with this. Uh, who do I want to use? Like, I want to use like the weakest of the weak, I assume. Vera... I don't have any flyers with me, so I guess it's fine. A uh, vague Sully. Uh, I want to have like characters that I'm more attached to. So get of Stall and Kellum, because I hate him. Uh, Cordelia and Libra. Might be asking for trouble if I do that though. Uh. Just trying to wonder who's the weakest. I know it's probably not going to reflect their levels. Unless it does. Let's see. And then via the map, we'll have Lucina and Tiki. Where, wherefore art thou? I still have Tiki equipped, right? Tiki was not equipped. Um, well, in that case, we'll get rid of... Uh... Who am I least attached to? Uh, in this group, Gregor. I don't care about him. Uh, we'll get Tiki back in here. Uh, we'll make sure that they're close together. And then we will have 
Basilo and Flavia right here. This is going to be really stupid. I guess the countermeasure is that, like I said, if Aversa dies, then we can't recruit her. So it would be smart to bring in strong allies just so we can protect her. Hopefully she doesn't need protecting. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to try this once. If it doesn't work the first time, then I'm just going to go back to my strong group. But hopefully, if I could just kill them all right away, that'd be amazing. Why don't you be like the fully maxed out uh, Super Saiyan Donald? Because Donald actually is the strongest character in the game if you level him up properly. But yeah, they all have the same... They have better weapons, but they all have the same level as they would... In the same class as normal, so... This could be doable. Let's see, Tiki with Lucina. Uh... Flavia with Basilo. Krom's unfortunately not really good with anyone. I'll pair him up with Cordelia just so I could get him around the board quicker. This is so stinking stupid. Oh my god. Uh, let's have uh, Viron and Sully. It's so weird using these characters. What the fruit? Who, are you? Who even are you guys? Donald with Muriel, I guess. Vake? Libra? Uh, Vake with Libra, I guess. Gaius with Rickon. We could barely move. That's amazing. Uh, we're just gonna go for it, I guess. Stand right up there. Get Krom up here. Oh, this is gonna be horrible. I can already tell this is going to be a big stinking train wreck, but might as well try it out. Okay, what do we got? Uh, who is it? It's Lucina. Okay, one of the strong ones right off the bat. Basilo was holding a bow, so we couldn't counterattack. Cool beans. Thank you for guarding, at least. Okay... Uh, he got a counter, that's nice. Just like every singing character in singing Smash Brothers. Like, anytime a character has a singing counter attack, like, I just get immediately bored with them. I'm just like, ugh, why is Beatdown always a counter? Why is Cave Rule have a counter? So singing weird. And, uh, he's gonna die, isn't he? Uh, I know you will. Oh, you actually missed! Hooray! Oh, something's actually coming up Millhouse for once. Oh, I should have had Tiki in front so she could counterattack whatever. Thank you for guarding, though. I appreciate it. And you guys can't do diddly squat. I'm glad that they can't pair up, though. That'd be annoying as heck. Uh, Muriel, can you heal Basilo? Yes, you can. Wow, I actually used a character properly. He was like one of these minor characters. It's so stinking weird. Well, it's a fun little trip down memory lane, I guess, if anything. Uh, let's switch to Aversa, because I know she could have a much easier time with these guys. Uh, not easy enough, though. Could take out Krom. But could Basil Basilo can do that on his own? Let's go for it. Thank you. Okay, that was really good. So, Krom's down. Uh, let's see. Could Lucina take herself out? I was hoping she could. If I just got closer, but no, now Basilo's in the open. He's gonna get hurt. Uh, he's... Libra's got mend. He could get up here. I could also take that this Libra. I could take out all these guys, though, so... Let's focus on the Lucina, since she's the biggest threat. Let's see, can I get some criticals? Okay, dodging's also nice. Uh, let's get Libra up here and mend Basilo again. Very good. I uh, can't reach these guys. Krom is right here. I'm gonna create a barricade right here. Well, she could just walk right through us, can't she? So that's not going to help us. 
A Versa's gonna come down and murder these guys. Which isn't great. Krom, you should just stay here on this side. So that you could fight Aversa. A clone at least. Um Rickon, stay here. Maybe you'll surprise me. And Veer, I should move you guys. Since I was couldn't create a wall, but she's just gonna walk right through us. What do we got? I'm going for Maribel. Uh, thank you for guarding. Oh, that's not good. Want to guard again? Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. Okay, down she goes. Uh, Versa is gonna murder Rickon probably. Or no, that's Muriel. Okay, my bad. Oh boy. All that inconceivable, considering you're like the lamest character in this game. Oh boy. You can attack twice! I was wondering about that because, like, I was like, wait, didn't Aversa already uh, hit someone? And, like, when she was killing Chrome, I was like, wait, didn't she already get her turn? No, she did go twice! She has a move that lets her go twice. That's pure stinking evil. Uh, we both have a 0% chance of hitting, so that's nice. Uh, please get some good counterattacks in here. Come on, come on, oh, Libra. No. Uh, Libra is, was gonna be a mainstay on this team, but we sort of just ran out of spaces, and I chose him over. I chose Sumia over him. So I think if we kept him, we might have had one more child unit uh, chapter, but oh well. I uh, very much appreciate you getting rid of Rickon. Okay. Do that. Up next we have. The uh, Shadow Vake, the ultimate life form. Okay. This is such a weird stinking thing. Imagine if this stinking works, I'll be amazed. Aversa is our biggest stinking problem, though. We just need to get rid of her because she could attack twice and she could very easily murder the other Aversa that's going after her right stinking now. Oh, boy. Just hurry up and finish this. Oh, great. Shadow Maribel's actually being useful. Ally phase, what are you doing? Don't do anything stupid, thank you. Uh huh. What's a matter of King Krom kill her? Of course not. So we're gonna have to have Tiki go back, switch, attack Aversa from a distance, and then Krom will finish her off. She's the absolute biggest threat, so I'm not too upset with doing this right now. If Lucina wants to or that could happen! Okay. Good job. So now I can bring Crumb up here. Is that safe? I'll have to think about that real quick. Uh, Shadow Flavia is our biggest threat. Uh, there's also Shadow Lucina. Shadow Tiki's still here. We only got her Shadow Crom, like out of the big boys. Did we get her Shadow Basilo? Uh, looks like it. I just don't feel entirely safe bringing Krom up there yet, like on his own. So for that reason, Sully, let's see if you can still kick butt like back in the old days. Switch your, well, Beast Killer is probably the best thing you have, honestly. Gaius, uh, do what a thief does best, I guess. Uh, you got a 19 experience. We'll have... Uh, where's... Are Lucina and Tiki right there? Cordelia, can you take care of them? You can't. Uh, let's switch to Flavia. I was really hoping you could take her out. Hmm. Let's just have a guaranteed kill at least. Of uh, I feel like Flavia would be furious if Basilo took out Shadow Flavia. Just because then he would have an excuse to say he's uh, stronger than her, so I'll avoid that confrontation and just have her fight him instead. Very good. Okay. Up next is with... Rickon, can you get rid of these weaker units? You could! That's amazing. A uh, Vake, you could... Wait, Vake doesn't even have a weapon he could use! What the fruit? God darn it. Meat shield. 
Ahoy. Okay, you're gonna get rid of Donald. Because everyone can get rid of stinking Donald. Very good. Oh, now he won't be able to go see Shadow Maw. Oh my god, and I, I'm actually really having fun with this just because A, it's working, and B, it's just a trip down memory lane of all the characters I didn't get to use because I didn't use a rotation team. So hopefully someone out there appreciates this. Uh, we'll have Cordelia right here in case we want to get Krom to swoop in and fight some guys. Enemy phase. So she's going for Rickon. Oh boy, Flavio want to protect him? Well, it's a 100% chance, so no. Well, at least you go for him and not uh, other unit. That would have been more crucial. Uh, Shadow Lucy is definitely the biggest threat. Oh, well, maybe the Shadow Tiki's going to murder everyone. I don't know. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Okay, down goes Shadow, or no, regular Sully. All these thinking names, uh, all these doppelgangers. Uh, there goes Veron. No surprise there. Is Viren always automatically the first character you get in Fire Emblem Heroes when you summon someone for free? Because I've seen like memes about that and he was my first hero that I summoned. So I feel like it is like that. I don't know why they chose him of all people, but whatever. I guess because you could only go up from there. I don't know. Oh, uh, we got... Uh, Vake versus Vake. Uh, who's going to win? The Vake with the weapon or the one without the weapon? Somehow you survived, Vake. Okay. I won't question it. I'll just be grateful. Okay. And guys, is probably going to go down. Oh, he did it. Cool. And also, thank you for not going for Cordelia. I'm not sure if you were able to or not, though. Uh, she's using the Balagna. And now they're going for Cordelia. It's a Sully. Spheres, are they the same as bow and arrows? I'm not sure. Uh, hey, I would appreciate if you helped us out right here. Thank you. Very, very good. Uh, oh, you also have the double dip. Very nice. And thank you for not going after Tiki, because I was afraid that she might murder you. Uh, but now I got to get rid of her then. Switch to Krom. He can do it! Yay! And I doubt any of these other dudes are going to be able to murder him, so let's just go for it. Uh, thank you for dodging. There you go. Oh my god, this actually stinking work. This is an awesome little detour. I love this. Um, let's have... We gotta get rid of this Lucina. Is she the only threat left? She is. Okay, we'll focus all our energy on her then. Uh, Philly. Just wish we could not get hit by her. 25, let's go for it. Let's get a critical. Yeah. Maybe we can finish her off. There we go. Yeah, this chapter's in the bag. We don't have anything to worry about anymore. Okay. Can anyone take anyone out? Gaius, you could fight uh, the Shadow Cordelia, but she'll kill you. Uh, we'll have... I guess we'll have these guys go up here then. Uh, I wish we could get rid of that Veron though, because I don't want him going for Cordelia. Uh, let's go. Go for Tiki then, get rid of the Vake. There can only be room for one Vake in this world. And I guess I'll just use everyone else as a meat shield because it would be beneficial to just continue on with da -da -da -da, communication sessions with uh, Tiki and these guys. Hey, Basilo actually went through an entire battle without dying. What a shock. It's a Christmas miracle. Going for Gaius. I'm okay with that. Oh, he wants his sugar. What's his sugar mama? Oh boy. There goes Vake going for... Uh, Viron going for Vake. I'm fine with that. And... V Vake, you do not deserve to be alive for this thing. Well, you have no stinking weapon. Whatever. Hey, it's actually... Uh, it's like when we first met at the beginning of the game, he didn't have his weapon. Muriel had to give it to him. That's kind of funny. It's like coming full circle. Okay, I appreciate it. And she's going to go again. If you want easy mode, then just get a Versa and have her uh, murder the final boss like this, because she could hit Stinkin' twice, and really stinking hard, it seems. Let's go and finish this up. Tiki, get rid of Viron. 
Well, this was a pleasant little detour. I'm happy that it didn't work out on the first try. Go do that. And finally, we will get rid of this guy, or gal. The most insignificant for last. So many words with O at the end of it. Basil and Flavio, I'm glad it wasn't like a random group that would have made no sense. No! No! What is it? What do you see? I saw myself. That's what I say every time I look in a mirror, too. A girl enslaved mind, body, and soul by Validar. What? Enslaved? <laughs> Truth is a bitter satisfaction. I would sooner have died than to know it. I should have never come here. Listen. What did you see? Master Validar. I thought I was so clever all this time. In truth, I was nothing but a fool. Validar stole my memory and filled my mind with a false past. Saving my life, taking me in, all lies. My entire history invented just so he could use me like a puppet. What? Gods, that's horrible. I was a girl like any other before he met me. Well, a bit gifted perhaps, but otherwise I led a normal life. Fate alone led Validar to my village, where he first learned of my talents. But cruel design saw him kill all who knew me and strip away my past. Then he had the audacity to play the role of savior. No. How depraved. <laughs> After that, I became the woman you all know and love. Say what you will about Validar. The man knew talent when he saw it. But in the end, I was just another pawn in his game. A pawn working in the service of her parents' murderer. Gods, I could not be more of a fool. What will you do now? Well... Validar is dead, but the one he served still lives. I'll bury Grima deep, and perhaps my past life with him. Puppet or no, I have wrought terrible atrocities. Slaying Grima will not unwork that evil, but perhaps it may spare others my fate. Good. If you would fight, fight with us. We'll stand a better chance together than going in alone. I've seen you fight, Aversa. You'd be a most welcome ally. <laughs> Even after all that we've been through, you'd still have me at your side. Hmm, very well then. They say politics makes strange bedfellows, but surely this war trumps all, no? And we got Spirit Dust and Bullion L as a, as a reward for that ridiculous battle. We are done recruiting allies from the dead, but there is still one more ally that we could recruit before the end. It's actually quite a surprise, and not one that people would expect, or one that people would be possible to expect, if you know what I mean. Next time on Fire Emblem Awakening, we are going to recruit one more ally before taking on the ultimate evil. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.